بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله ربي اشرح لي صدري ويسر لي امري واحلل عقدة من لساني يفقهوا قولي Hello brothers and sisters, how are you? Uh, in uh, today's lesson, I would like to show you how we can create a double layer uh, material wall in uh, Revit and after that uh, converted or exported to uh, Lumion. So we uh, we will uh, put in the materials in Lumion and we have uh, interior and exterior uh, face of the wall. Uh, the idea is very simple. Um, uh, for that, I will open a new project. Uh, let's say uh, this one, Metri Architectural uh, Template. So I will say OK. And after that, I will make uh, some kind of walls. Uh, every time we set the unit first, we can, what we can do, we can, uh, for the length, we can use meter for uh, like this project. OK. Uh, of course, we have two decimals. Uh, Let's say OK. So after that, we will go to walls. From the walls, what we uh, are going to use, we are going to use uh, a wall which has two uh, faces. OK, which has two faces or uh, two layers, let's say. For example, this one, we can increase increase and decrease the layers uh, or what, what we have. So I will uh, select this one. And for the height, I will say up to level two. And I will use something like um, this, for example. And after that, I will go with uh, this uh, kind of wall. And maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe from here, this point to that point. I think maybe and another one here. Anyhow, so it's just a simple, uh, a simple um, walls. And if I go with this one, and after that I will change it to this to fine and this to realistic, uh, and I can see uh, the materials is here, the exterior and interior material. That is very good, but uh, as you see here, what I can do, uh, or what uh, I want to do, uh, I want to make uh, these materials, uh, or maybe each uh, room here, uh, we uh, want to put a material. So for this is here, I can, I can put two uh, separate materials for this one and the uh, two for this and maybe two for this as well. But uh, while uh, I put uh, this one here because it's one wall, so it will put for uh, this one and this one will be, uh, this and that will be the same. So for this one, uh, I'll just click uh, this wall and I'll split it. Uh, what I can do, I can just uh, click SL for split, right? For split and just split it here, just like this, and cancel it after that. And if we go uh, now, escape it, you see, now I have this wall and this wall. And if, of course, if, if I want to be uh, this part or split with this one, again, I have to, I have to separate it from, from this part because here, here we have uh, for this face, this face is shared with this one uh, and with this row. Anyhow, it's not uh, the great thing. So we can, again, we can split this one. That's very good. And what we have here, we have parts, right? Uh, after that, what we can do, we can just create, uh, create parts, okay? And uh, maybe exclude parts, uh, you see now we have some some parts one two three uh, or uh, even if I go back just like this we, we can we can now we have we have this these parts right uh, this one is one wall but this one we have parts again uh, we can just click this one and create parts uh, you see it will create uh, parts for us so I'll, I'll select all of it and I'll say create parts anyhow so now Everything will became parts, and now I can put uh, for each one a uh, material. But uh, I have to I have to be sure that I export it in a, uh, in a right way. For example, when I uh, I'll say file export and uh, cat or let's try it first with FBX, uh, and I will say on desktop and maybe e p tutorial just like this name it 
something like this it will say also save and after that i will go to lumion and i will say new uh less from uh here or maybe even if this one i can't do it after that i will import it uh, i will go with uh, my desktop a tutorial i'll bring this one uh here i have to just rename it or make a new model because this one is uh, all already exist i'll say okay escape it later after that uh when i see you see for example i'll go with two materials you see each one each one has the same material why we 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 did some we did some some parts but now everyone became one wall and became one material so what's the solution for that the solution for that is very easy uh we have to change something in in the uh, revit itself so after that we can we can do it uh this for uh, with uh, fbx uh, let's try this time with cat format uh let's say dwg uh again the same process uh, let's say we have the second option two op2 so just like this okay and i'll bring now uh this time i'll bring uh, another uh object which is dwg we said that dwg op2 okay I'll bring this one we see escape it again go to material I'll you see again is the same thing so uh, how can I how can I solve this problem is this the second option I'll bring the third option and I'll uh, the third option will be will work for us ah. so what's the solution for that the solution for that is very easy uh, brothers uh, I will go to the file and I will go to export and I uh, will go to go down and I will go export uh, setup DWG DXF and uh, what I have I have walls I'm working work, working with walls and I'll just cl uh, click here what we have here you see we have uh, all kind of, of uh, wall sweep curtain uh, cut pat pattern finish one finish two uh, we have all of these are the same the same uh, layer okay so what I'm doing now I'm just just name it uh, the layers okay let's say this number one and this number two just try to name it uh, so what this makes uh, this will uh, take all of the uh each layer or each part each part from the structure and uh, uh, any kind of uh, thickness or uh, membrane material uh, layer will take uh, each will take a separate uh, layer and after that we can control it uh, control the layers this says here here uh, this is the cornish and I'll make something like this. However, we don't have all of this, okay? Uh, but anyhow, we can we can proceed with this. I'll say okay, and now I will go to file, export, export here this time with DWG, and I'll say option three, option three, and we see with the option three what will uh, happen. After that, I will go back to the Lumion and I will go to import, and I will go with option three. Yes, let's bring it just like this escape it okay so now I have uh, these kind of material we see uh, what's the difference or ca can we put the materials with each uh, each layer we have to see if it's not take this uh, this kind of uh, thing uh, so we did, did a mistake okay we did a mistake so uh, here is the same thing but uh, I have to go back to Revit and uh, go back to export i have to be sure that i applied the uh, the walls yeah each one is very good uh here oh sorry uh, the layer is here is the same thing 
Uh, I'll read this one. So it, uh, each one will take uh, a layer. Okay, wall interior. Here we have walls interior, walls in, uh, foundation exterior. Uh, I will complete with this one because we have, uh, yeah, I have to finish with this one because we had some others and line from here also yeah from the colors uh well, what i'm going to do i will use specified in view rgb this one okay uh so this is this the 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 the, the point that we have to consider also as well so okay and after that i will go to the for uh export exporting cat and uh, this time is option four op4 uh we see now we see this time we see uh, everything should be solved. Uh, we will try. Just bring it and import again. Option four. Okay. You see now. Uh, you can you can fill from from the start point. Uh, you can fill all of uh, the walls that we have now is uh, is okay. Okay. You see. I can I can put the material for the inner and outer. Uh, this is the exterior side okay i'll put the material for the exterior side i'll choose this one i'll go to the outdoor maybe bricks and uh, for the bricks maybe this one this one that one whatever i want but now i will go indoor and i will go to stone you see this is all of it it's the same part but if i want again i can i can change the material from the rivet we we learned before and we can do it uh, you see what kind of, of stone we need uh, for example this kind of stone and these and that whatever whatever we choose or maybe tiles I don't know mm, it's up to up to your uh, up to you uh, I'll not use any kind of uh, or uh, I can use uh, any kind of, of uh, walls you see here this is the interior this exterior exterior interior they are two different materials so this is all about the uh, how we can solve you see now we have this one also is this is effect on on uh, and this is the the the, the exterior uh, again uh, i have to uh, well, while i i use it i have to put another type of, of uh, wall so uh, i can delete this one uh, right uh, I have to I have to uh, use a type that has only two layers and uh, this one is here is three layers and I will use uh, another separate uh, one or uh, I can duplicate it okay uh, anyhow so uh, this is the uh, for uh, today's uh, lesson I think now everything is clear so you can use whatever uh, you want and uh, whatever material you want with two uh, or double-sided material okay this is the double-sided material uh, that we could use uh, this one the double-sided material now after that i can i can just say okay i can go to render uh, from go to photos and after the, for the photos I think uh, now we can do whatever we want for example oh, uh, sorry uh, I can go to customs uh, re I can use realistic you see realistic and I think it gives us a, a very uh, good thing we can go to from the real skies we can change the uh, uh, heading lies the direction or the source of the of the, of the uh the source of the uh, light coming from and i think uh, so we can use increase and decrease brightness overall uh, and we can say say flip sky and uh, anyhow uh, just we can render store this this one if we want after that we whatever we will want we can just uh make it brightness vibrance tint 
we can use temperature uh, whatever uh, high limit low limit we can uh, play around situation anyhow after that just we can uh, click render photo and here we don't we need only uh, for a desktop and let's name it as render save it just okay and i think uh, this uh, for today hope you enjoyed thank you very much